I welcome you all to the program Astrology in the Light of Science. Probably right from our childhood, all of us have a dream to be a doctor in future. Have we ever thought that whether becoming a doctor is there in our luck, in our fortune, in our coolly astrologically? students, our children are spending years of years taking preparation to crack the joint entrance examination to get an entry in the field of medical profession. We, the parents, also are trying our best. We are not leaving any stones unturned, putting our effort to make our children a good doctor, a medical professional. Is it prudential to think that all the students have that? potential to be a doctor? Is it prudential to think that all the students have the potential to be an engineer? Nowadays having a degree is not that much challenging because all of us know that nowadays in our country, in everywhere in the world, private institutions have been developed. They are ready to give a degree. But merely getting a degree is enough. After getting the degree, whether our children will be able to prove their as a good medical professional, have we ever thought about that? Have we ever thought that what is the psychosomatic pattern or knack or mentality? Our children was born with. Have we ever thought about that? Today's program is on that topic. Astrology is, I think, one and only tool with the help of that. We come to know beforehand that our children will build their career in the medical profession. What are the planets responsible? What are the significant houses responsible? What are the important astrological jewels should be there in our Kundli to be a good medical professional to be a good doctor in future otherwise getting admitted in any private college and getting a degree from that the consequence will be will not be up to the mark Consequence will not be a favorable one. In fact, I have 
experienced in my 30 years of experience in this practice and in this domain that in spite of their reluctance, students have been forced to choose this field, engineering or medical profession and they have frustrated, they have been frustrated and even after getting a degree with a good result, they have no interest to work in that field. Now I will tell you some important houses which are responsible, very uh, significant. Fifth house, as we know that fifth house indicates the higher study. In general, as you know that fourth house indicates the primary education up to 10th class, 5th house indicates up to graduation or master degree and 9th house indicates the PhD or postdoc. <laughs> So fifth house definitely is important because definitely a student should have good knowledge in his or her 10 plus 2 standard before he or she starts preparing for the entrance exam. So fifth house definitely is responsible. Along with this sixth house, sixth house connects with the health disease the so sixth house is associated with the medical profession tenth house it is a general house which represents our profession so what are the planets placed in the tenth house that must be checked and twelfth house twelfth house does not only signify the draining it also signifies the hospital the job associated with the hospital or nursing home or any health uh, organization now some important astrological jokers it with this Yogas, a true astrologer, will be very, very affirmative with his or her prediction that this guy will prove himself or herself a renowned medical professional in his or her life. For example, I already mentioned one of this, Udaipta Yoga when Sun and Mercury is placed in the same house better if it gets placed in 6th house or 10th house but a very specific a special yoga for the medical profession that is if the 5th house lord and 10th house lord interchanges positions for example if the fifth house lord is placed in 10th house and 10th house lord is placed in fifth house for example for the ascendant aries if the sun is placed in capricorn and if the saturn is placed in leo this guy will prove himself or herself very very renowned doctor in his or her life so this is the way the prediction should be done otherwise he will always be in dark that's why I always tell I always suggest 
the parents that please before you decide which profession will be suitable for your children you should reach to an educated astrologer and you should take from him by written that you give me on written it, it should be documented that these are the technical factors on the basis of this you are saying that my children my children will uh, will not be able to be a doctor or will be able to be a doctor what are the astrological reasons that you should ask for always <clears throat> now the dream which our children causes right from our, from their childhood that they have this knack to choose this profession but for the a pressure uh, from the parents and they their uh, dream many times their dream doesn't uh, get the right consequences so this is not true that uh, everyone should be a doctor everyone should be an engineer everyone should be a judge a lawyer because you know that all of us are born with a specific psychosomatic pattern that come from our past karmas maybe from the past life the karmic effect gets inherited we are born with this so if our decision gets aligned with that psychosomatic pattern only then we can flourish we can be a happy human being with the profession we will always be blissful we will always be happy with our profession which we like to choose otherwise merely making a uh, money from the profession will not sustain at times the people get fatigue like myself this is my passion the astrology this domain is my passion along with the domain the engineering right from my childhood i had a knack that what is the in astrology how much it is true how much it matches with our real life and i started investigating and by luck i got some great masters those were not professional that time from them i learned so many things in astrology what will be the remedy i can i am ready to invest any amount but anyhow my children uh should be a doctor i get confused sometimes that why what i would answer them <laughs> I used to tell them that even you spent crores, crores of money, your son or your daughter will not be able to be a good doctor. 
you can get him or admitted in a private college investing a huge amount of money he or she may achieve a degree but after that only getting a degree will be the will be the consequence nothing else and they will spend their whole life with frustration they can manage a job in a nursing home where there is no that kind of scope for them to prove their competence or they will not feel like good in their profession forcefully they will be there because that time after becoming after getting a degree of mbbs or md they there is there there should not be any other alternative to choose right so they have to spend their whole life with us do you want that so this is my request to all the parents don't force your children to choose the field which you want let them choose if they are not able or if you are not able to take the decision you reach an astrologer and you should know the what are the reasons what are the astrological factors responsible what only your children is having by birth you cannot change it right or sometimes it happens that we get every possible connections the astrological reasons to be a good doctor but because of not having sufficient power of some planets they may suffer may not the students may not get a good rank that time we suggest remedies but before that the astrological connections must be there na astrological connections to be a doctor must be present over there otherwise we can you cannot shift a planet from one house to another right because that this person this your children is born with this only na you cannot change it you cannot you can you can boost up the strength of a particular planet with some remedies so remedies definitely but before that if it is not possible if no sufficient reason is not there for your children to be a good doctor that's the legal reason then you should abstain taking the decision right so that's all today's program i think this program will be very helpful for you and if you get to know that yes you have the every possibility to be a good good doctor the students will be very motivated taking the preparation right they will be charged up taking the preparation that's yes this is there this profession is for me only right so with this confidence they will move on right so uh i would suggest all of you to consult with a good astrologer educated astrologer 